Igbo. Instead of that, we just come to meet Bini, say, please help us. And Bini will help you. If Bini Kingdom decide to step their feet inside Biafra, now for don't get Biafra, take three. Well, ask everybody. If Bini stand up, say, Biafra is where we stand. <laughs> you know, what they do to Tinubu. Tinubu saying that the when we feel decide who will be governor, they tell us, say, okay, this is not Yoruba land. This is Bini. Not only are we powerful, we decide what happened. You cannot. Is it because Bini decided to just quiet? Because our boys and girls decided to just travel abroad. You can just come on and can be talking anyhow. Don't even talk about the house. They have their own uniqueness. All of us have our own uniqueness. Because Bini is the only surviving kingdom that still uphold the true African royalty. No other kingdom in the world. No other kingdom in the world still maintain the ancient the ancient climatic, the ancient African spirituality. But you know what? The news media will not carry it. They will never carry anything that will give Africa respect. Ask yourself, why is it, the, why is it that it's only beneath that they came to fight? Why? Why, why is Bini under, under, under heat? I'm an Isoko man. I'm an Edo man. I consider myself as an Edo man because I'm an Isoko person. I lived in Iyede, a community in Isoko land. I'm a reincarnation of a great man that spore the Delta down to the Bayesa, down to the Edo. Agbidi was his name. Onisha King. Onisha, call Onisha Nambra State. Onisha King will tell her the truth. He will tell her, say, please, please, please. We don't want to be near Allah. We don't want. He's our father. Your true king will turn back on her. Tell her, say, we don't know what you know they dragged before. We are all from Bini land. Don't try to compare a do state as to just a state. No. Our force span through the whole of the Delta region of Africa. So before you come to this video and start talking anyhow, let me tell you something. We will not fight you. We don't need to. We are royalty. The Bini, the Edo, the Deltans who recognize their root in Edo, we are royalty. We don't fight. Why do we call ourselves royalty? Because everybody is not a king in their do. Or like the Igbo, everybody is a king. And they come out to say they have what is called uh, a whatever. So anybody can rise up and become a leader of a group. Anybody can rise up and start something. Everybody will be following that person. Anybody can become. But in their do land, you can't just rise up and talk. We don't, we don't misbehave here. Everybody is not king in the do land. But everybody is a member of the royal family. Everybody is a chief. But everybody is not a king. Because the Edo man is the only man that actually carried the lesson, the lecture, the life, the culture of the great grandfather to the grandfather and to the present generation. So also the Yoruba. The Yoruba cannot do without their pantheon. So they love their spirituality, the Yemoya, the Shango, the, the far religion to be precise. The Yahusa has their own, they have the Amina, they have the Caliphate, they are all of them there. The fighting spirits, the warrior spirits that we inherited from our ancestors, from the Bini, is still in us. This is what they do for uh, Igbo land. That only a select group of people will hold a whole state to ransom in the name of sit at home until you have respect for your elders growth will remain stunted the world is enough for the wise